doing up my lips, but I need to brush my teeth. But, yeah. Didn't like the brown look today. Because I've got this brown top on. And my olive trousers on. I would say they're olive tone. I want to take a photo. Because I've not done an outfit of the day on Instagram for quite a while. And we're gonna get on with the day. First stop, Costa. I might get this for like night out. I got that bag from New Look. I will show you it properly when I go home. But I got it because one, I'm hoping to go to this bingo thing at some point at the end of January. So. That would be like my going out bag and also it was so cute. I can wear it even without going like out out like to the shops and that. But also I'm I got the second manifesting book. So Papa show you when I go home but I got the orange one ages ago and now the girl who got it has bought out a number two so i got that today as well it was 12 pounds in the works or nine pounds at asda so i just got it in asda and now i'm going to get some coloring pens from b&m that's like a collection thing and then i'm going to color in after my appointment when i get home so let's go to b&m mind my double chin other things I'm on about. I'm not gonna get that pack because I've got loads of like you don't need so many browns and so many things. I've got that pack already and I've got this pack. I'm sure it's this pack. I'm sure it's this pack or that pack. So I'm getting the purple, the green you can't see the blue, but I'm getting this one as well. And then I've got three concrete for the dog rooms. It's like wooden sticks. Got the green. So I'm back from the shops and I am freezing. It is starting to get cold again. But let me show you everything that I got from the shop. I didn't get much, I spent a lot, but I didn't, well I did get quite a lot, but like I wouldn't class it as a shopping spree, like when you go to Edinburgh or Glasgow, but I did get quite a lot, mainly colouring in pen, pens, but let me show you everything that I got. This is my stitch bag I try and take whenever I go shopping, because one you need to pay for a bag, but also it's just convenient and it's cute now they this bag was meant to be one of those bags that have like the bag that you can put the bag in but it fell off so i just scrunch it up in my bag how many times do i have to say bag i don't know what's inside first thing that i got i showed you guys but let me show you in the film is this 
new look skinny dip bag now you probably realize i quite like my bags because i got one a couple of weeks ago but i do feel like you can never have too many bags or shoes even though i love my fashion and that and i've got so many clothes and everyone will admit i've got so many clothes but to me it's like you can get loads of shoes because you can style them so many different ways you want different outfits and it's the same with bags i've really got into bags right now styling them with different outfits so this is like my going out bag i'll probably say that and i'll use it for one night out but also i can use it for like if i don't need that much so it's one of those small ones that you can just hold like that like, I don't know. I've never really had a really small bag like this, but I really like liked it and I fell in love with it. And I've also got like earrings that pretty much look like the golden star and the golden golden star and golden moon. I mean, but you also get one of these with it. So let's pop that on and see what it looks like. So it's a bit bent because it's been like all together but when it's been out of the packaging for a while it should be fine. This was £28 but because I used my one of my Christmas gift well my my Christmas gift card with £15 on it, it was £13. So not too bad for a skinny dip product, I don't think. And the bags are normally like £30 or more, so to me that's not too bad. So that's what it looks like with this strap. That is so cute. Obviously it does, it does go with this outfit, but it is a proper dressy bag like you can tell it's meant for like a dress or a smarter outfit not a brown and green outfit like I'm wearing right now but that's what it looks like and I really love it it's so cute and also it's got like silver details in so even if I have like silver the main thing is gold but even if I have silver like earrings and like jewelry like this it won't clash too much because it's got like mi a mixture of silver and gold on to the next thing i got next thing i got was from asda now i did go to the works to see if they had this book but it was 16 pounds 16 pounds down to 12 pounds and then asda is nine pounds and i have got so as many of you guys may know i love my like manifesting books changing your life books stuff like that i've really got into them types of books this year or last year actually and i am reading this one right now i'm like a quarter of the way i'm getting back into reading because i went a couple of months without reading and i really want to get back into it so i had this one and i've read this book the whole way through it was the first manifesting book i got and i don't think the book changed like my outlook or something but pretty much did just the right and the way she talks about law of attraction um oh my god every time i get these books something happens to them um law of attraction and stuff like that S seven steps to living your best life stuff like that it really did help and at the time i found i found it at the time i found I don't know if it was just my outlook on life or like 
little things or the way I reacted to life. I don't know. If you read this book or if you know anything about manifesting, you probably know what I mean. Like, manifesting is kind of just your thoughts, your the way you look at different situations. And these go into, this book goes into the steps of manifesting. And this book goes more into detail about the steps of manifesting. Step on one right now is like action. Another one that I remember is one is like feelings and then vibrations, stuff like that. There's loads of steps. It's really interesting, I find. So that was number one and I read it all. This is now number two. She just recently bought out. I don't know when she bought it out, but I saw it in Asda yesterday and I thought I would get it today. So this one is Manifest Dive Deeper. And the writer, I don't know if she writes this book herself, but that's her name. And it says, unlock your limited potential create lasting transformation transmit transformation may change and turn your dreams into reality with pretty much i need to read it and it takes some words i can't read properly because of my learning disability so that's also another reason why reading is good because it makes me learn more pretty much well, the way I explain it is, to me, let me know in the comments if you are like this as well. With a learning disability, if I, could, if I don't continue doing a certain thing, I kind of lose the skill. Or it, it feels like I've lost the skill. But definitely starting to realise what type of genre or types of books I like has really helped me read more <laughs> I assume because I've got loads of books I've not read but I don't want to chuck them because they're like my favourite Netflix movie or my favourite Netflix series stuff like that but these types of books I really love so I'm going to start reading this one next well probably not this one next because I've got loads that I have bought recently, the past couple of months, and I'm still on to make it happen. But I'm getting back into reading. That's the point of this story. <laughs> the last thing I got was from B and M, and that is. Let me put them in order. Well, not in order, but just so you can see the colours. And that is these colouring pens these are like brush pen well they're not like brush pen these are brush pens and fine pen and i love them i've got a set already i will show you after i show you everything and i'm going to show you how you can connect them they are really cool and then the last thing i got was for my dogs or family dogs and it was these wood tree bones one flavored barbecue make quick flavor and one's liver flavor if they would like that and normally you don't find a two pack for two separate dogs like this was only three pounds for two of them so one can have the liver one and one can have the barbecue one so it was a good offer I find because B&M toys are normally like three pounds each so by the time I get one toy I need to get another and it comes up to like six pounds it's ridiculous but I love them both that is everything I got from B&M, Asda and New Look can't wait to use my new bag and start reading this and I'm sure the dogs will enjoy their dog toy when I finally give them it and also I'm going to show you how these are the ones I've got already I've got the pink ones and like 
the orange skin colour one. That's why I didn't get the brown ones like I explained because I've already got brown ones and my sister gave me her ones as well. I just wanted loads of different shades. So I've got as many brown ones as I need. It was just getting loads of like different colourful ones like purple, blues, pink and yellows. So I don't know how to show you over here. So there's these little clippy bits here and I will show you it now. What you need to do first is take them out of the packaging. Things look like that. That looks so nice. They look so them colours look so nice. I'm gonna cut off halfway for the clip, but these are the in pens i always forget what they're called but color and in pens will be fine i'm gonna organize them by number and then i will show you what they actually look like i did say in the last clip i don't know if it, it caught it but i did say that it's not gonna go from one to whatever number it goes to because i've not got the brown set because i've got a brown here these two like brownie colours and I've also got some colours right here that my sister already got me. So let me organise this. Now that is what it looks like. I need to try and put them properly together. But that is what it looks like. And I'm quite impressed with it. I like it. We are ending this vlog with me on the floor on my knees because I've been trying to do this. But I really recommend getting these, obviously. They're six pounds each line, so in the end, at the end of it, you are spending about thirty pounds. So you probably could get cheaper ones. Well, you definitely could get cheaper ones online, but I like these colours and I like the way it displays it. So I can easily put these on my desk now. I may get the brown ones in the future, mainly because the number isn't exactly. Ooh, so that should be them now but i mainly got them well one because i like brush coloring pens now that i've realized but also they are really easy to display on your desk or wherever you do your coloring in and they're easy to just bring down to her or <gasps> oh no don't do that Do not recommend doing that. Don't tip them upside down because it will take you ages to put them back in order. Now you don't need to put them in order if you don't want to, but I would like them to be. But well, it starts with two and then seven, then 10, then 20, 30, 33, 78, 79. So they're not exactly the same number. I need to try and sort this. But thank you for watching this vlog. I hope you enjoyed it. And I will see you with a brand new one soon, vlog or a video, but I'm trying to get really into vlogging again. And I feel like most of my content is around vlogging because I, I enjoy editing that type of content. And also it's just easier to talk about things, show you things. I just prefer the style of vlogging than a sit down video and showing you a haul. I just, I feel like it, it's more just me and you like it feels more genuine let me know in the comments if you think that too or if you would like me to do videos like this like do a come shopping with me and then do separate hauls i just find i don't get loads of things i i get loads of things <laughs> i will say that but i don't like get 
loads and loads of things enough to do just a haul a general just haul video. my camera cut off again because of how much vlogging i've been doing and not editing the vlog but there are two vlogs coming your way well this one and the one what might be before this one or after this one i'm thinking to put up the vlog i've already well i need to get one more clip but the vlog that i've already filmed and vlogged will go up first and then this vlog will go up but i hope you enjoyed this vlog and i will see you with a brand vlog a brand new vlog of a joe bye